That's a movie. <laughs> it's a good movie. <laughs> okay. We're all nostalgic, you know, we're showing our age. But like, um, well, wait. So Sam Neville's fire is the discharge at the top of a ship's mast. Yeah, right. And it was glow, and it was oh, that's beautiful. Said, no, dude, you're about to get hit by lightning. Lightning. <laughs> Say goodbye. Say goodbye. So, yeah. Can you Sama. explain ball lightning, please? I, I've heard of it. I've never even seen, like, pictures of it. But So it's it's a ball of ionized plasma, so, like, gas that's so hot that there's free electrons moving around. Okay. It persists for a while. Like, one of the scary things that I've heard of is, like, you're on, there was an incident on an airplane where this ball of lightning rolled down the aisle of the plane. And then left. How did it get in the plane? It came in a window or the side. I don't know. The plane is a closed It has thing. a travel agent. <laughs> <laughs> it wanted first class. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Uh, I just understand something. The plane is made of metal. How are you going to move ionized material through metal? I actually don't know how it got in. I mean, there's a report. And again, this is something where. It's eyewitness. eyewitness you, you report, work it as you can. You work as you can. There's a plane have, on some level is almost a Faraday cage. Yeah, right. And people have reproduced this phenomenon. And it might be a tangled magnet piece of magnetic field with a plasma on it. Holy we moly! We don't quite un so ball lightning. I'm not expert on this. My understanding is it's still not well understood.